What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Slick Eddie here, and um, um, if y'all didn't get the message, uh, stupid homemade tripod. Anyway, if y'all didn't get the message, I s canceled the voting thing and just decided that we were gonna do every single. I was gonna remaster every single old Minecraft world that I did back then. Back in the past, because my PlayStation 3 is literally about to die, and if I don't remaster my worlds soon, then it will be lost forever. So, hey buddy, you're cool, right? Yeah, you're cool. Have a golden apple. Here for you. So, if y'all didn't recall from the, um, right, two. Here, take one. Spider, I gave you one. Okay, he doesn't want it. So, if you didn't recall, there was an old classic Lego Minecraft world. I mean, a regular old Minecraft world that I told you called Winter with a um, snow and cobblestone house and a brick, ruined brick building with a ruined theater. Well, there it is. Remastered. Now, let's go further into it, shall we? Okay, welcome to Winter. Sorry, this stupid tripod is giving me a pain in the butt because I made it myself and it may not be good but it's uh can hold for now anyway this this is the entrance you know the old um s computer lab that I told you about that is made out of bricks and is has vines all over it and it's in the middle of the lake well I was able to remaster that and this one doesn't have like a lot of trees in it this time so this one is basically just visible all around and you basically just see everything so you walk in, and I replaced this. I actually turned this into a carrot farm for my horse. Oh, he can't eat hor can't eat carrots. Well, crap. I'll feed him my villager then. So we go inside. I replaced the um glass with trap doors. You know, just make it like like a better window. And this is the entrance. Instead of these chests, I have barrels that I can store all this stuff in. And I have basically corners of it all around. Hey, villager. Would you like some carrots? Yes, you would. You were hungry. Hey, buddy. Eat some. Yeah, and here's my computer. This is the computer this time with a better thing and a better PC. And this is the... I replaced the TV that I have in the old one with the air conditioning unit. We're cold. Where I can switch from the temperature in this house to cold or hot. Since I'm in the winter, I would switch it to hot. And here is a little pool with a little barbecue pit that I can make barbecues in. And then there is a little pond where we can swim and you know s take the tropical fish that you store in buckets and place them in there appeared in 1.13 update now I want to show you the new and improved brick building and new and improved out theater so you know these um glowstone pillars that you had to keep the light I replaced the glowstone with sea lanterns from the ocean monuments and over here, you can see that I made a brand new entrance gate for, to winter. There's a gate, also a gate right over there. But either way, it would have worked. And this is a brick house. As you can see, it's not ruiny at all. It's actually fixed. So this is a good place for someone who is joining to stay in. And the new and improved deck that I connected to the fence. And there is a theater that I told you about. New and improved, so you go in there, and you walk down these stairs, and you go into a Crimson Theater, watching Donkey Kong and shit. That, I, I'm actually glad, I think I did a really good job in the theater, I'm honestly glad. I think this is, this would also make a very, very awesome new structure into Minecraft, so people, that players can explore. Like a village, kinda. I think this would be a very good village, in my opinion, because of the farm, and the villagers, and the houses. And these brand new features and the loot loot barrels that you can look in. I think this would be a very good feature. So, um, but this is not the only cool feature about this world. It's also the seed. So let me pull up seed. And right over here, this entire seed is one of the best seeds ever. I'll show you why in just a moment. 
Okay, you just saw the seed, and I am gonna. Oh crap! Damn it! Damn it! Hold on. Um... Oh fuck me! Okay, we're gonna add that out, people. That did not happen. I need to fix this tripod. Like, soon. Okay. Come on, stop it. I hate this tripod. Okay, so I copied the seed, and now we're gonna create a brand new world in creative mode. I'm gonna show you what this seed is actually good for. First, we're gonna need a strength. So I'm gonna give myself the effect cheat on on strength Wait for this to generate this is a new a feature from 1.14 the village and pillage update where when you create a new world it'll show an animation of the world generating it's actually a very cool feature that they added to be honest because then you can see the world like map like generate okay what you need is i a vendor there we go and a shulker box let me show you how to craft a shulker box real quick. So, what you need is a crafting table, of course. One chest. And two shulker shells killed by killing shulker... Obtained by killing shulkers. So, you place the chest in the middle and three shulker shells on top of them and you boom. You get your shulker box. So, that's what you need. Now, I'm going to locate Stronghold. Amplifier level 60. This is a very good. This map is also shows a very, very cool looking end. Ew, whoa! Scratch that. This show also shows a very, very cool. This shows the end. Literally shows a stronghold underwater. Ooh. Not going in there. But we are going to go to the end portal. Wait, that's a library. Hey, monsters. Now, the thing about strongholds is that you can find loot chests with paper. In this room, you can find loot chests of paper, books, and sometimes enchanted books. Very useful, but if you don't like the enchanted book, then you can always grind them up in the grindstone to make it better show... So we can get a better enchantment. So, where else did I not go to? Um, this way. End portal. Come on. Okay. Um, new plan. I'm gonna go ahead and make myself a little thing. Get some sponge over here. The sponge came out in Minecraft 1.8 update. Give me that. Boom. Okay, I could have done that too. <laughs> We're gonna that out. Didn't happen. I'm doing good. Another library. <gasps> oh, that's a oh creepers. I must kill you. Why is there half light? Get out of here. Get him out of here. So I'm gonna try and look for an end portal. Damn. I know there's an end portal runner somewhere. Is it this way or see the thing about stronghold is that you have to look everywhere, but there's always one end portal in every stronghold, okay? So I know there's one there's gotta be one around here somewhere.
Okay, I know there's a stronghold around here somewhere, and I ain't trying to find it. Okay, that's just leads to the cell. I don't want to be arrested. I want to look for the stronghold. And the end port. Well, not stronghold. All right, fine. Oh, get out of here. How did that drown come from? Huh. There's got to be an end portal around here somewhere. There can't just not be one. There has to be one. Uh, taking forever. Shut up, spider. You're no help. What the hell? Get out of me. Uh, taking forever in here. Damn it. Where is the fucking end portal at? I want to know where it is. Get out of my way, you stupid monsters. Get out of my way. There. Why can't there be a end portal around here? Wait, I haven't been down here yet. Maybe. Okay, that's a little hallway. Yes, there are entrances. Man, this is a big ass stronghold or something because it's going on forever and ever and ever. Ooh. Yeah, they use strongholds to arrest other people, but I don't really know why they do that. Um, get rid of you. Uh, Alright, that's it. Uh, okay, look on the other sides. Ooh, a bow. Ooh, another bow. Thank you. I will go ahead and combine these two bows into one bow. You gotta be kidding me. Why isn't there an end portal? Why can't there be an end portal around here somewhere? Why the fuck do I hear drowned? Okay, I'm just gonna go. Oh, there's something bright and shiny. Oh, a loot chest. There are also loot chests in the stronghold. Don't really have much, but they are, can be a bit useful later on. Is there any way to find a freaking end portal? Um, I'm gonna pause this and let me know when I get that. Okay, finally found one. I don't know why I didn't think of this before after minutes and minutes on end, but the spectator mode is one of the good cheats to have when you're looking for a structure in the game. Wait, no, 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 not survival. What the fuck? There. I don't know why I did that. Okay. You need like 12 eyes of vendors. Get rid of you, 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 and you. And you, and you. And you, we go down to the portal. And we challenge and we destroy the end crystals. Watch this. Since I have super strength, and I'll just kill the dragon with one hit of my fist. What the 
hell? Oh, I need my strength. Oh! Who is this? Hey buddy, you're going down? Yes you are. Oh shit. Come on buddy, get down. Boom, oh no. Come on, get back here. Yeah, oh, ooh. Got your ass. Got your ass. Oh, got your ass. Okay, well, that's the end of Dragon. I just did it in creative mode with my super strength, because huh, I can't, and this is a creative world, so I can. So, we are going to go to the end, to the remote islands, with the coarse trees, the coarse fruit, and the end cities. This seed shows the best end cities ever. So, end cities are basically like, Little houses, little sky houses of end. Like end, end bricks and purple blocks obtained by smelting. Uh, smelting purp coarse fruit in the furnace. And there it is. This is the end city. This is one of the best kinds of end city. And here is a super rare end structure called the end ship. There, there is a super rare chance of an end ship spawn generating in each end city. Now, this is one, one of the few end ships. These are shulkers that attack you, and in here you can see that the end ships have very good loot, like gold, diamonds, even iron, enchanted iron, and diamond armor. I'm gonna go for this. Um, and there is a super cool item in the game called the elytra you can use it to fly in the game see the shulker box will just store everything that you have and the elytra i'll show you what it does after i kill this shulker and the end city end ship also has a dragon head that you can mine and collect as your own as you're going. No, I need to go to survival and do this, so. Game mode peaceful. See, you can fly in Minecraft. And this is the one of the very, so the end ship will give you an Elijah, which you can use to fly in Minecraft. Now, why is this a very good sea? Well, because there's literally a buttload of awesome loot. There's literally a buttload of awesome loot in it. Like enchanted diamond armor, diamonds, emeralds, and beetroot seeds. And there's another treasure room directly over there. So you have to pay attention to how many stacks this building has. So this, ha this has three stacks. If it's three stories, this one has two. But if this one has three stories, then there's a loot chest in this in it. See what I mean? Aha! See mending. Mending is where you can repair your diamond, your enchanted equipment, so you can reuse it over and over and over again. So that's why I like it. The enchanted stuff. Now, what shulkers do? So, this is just one of the end cities. There are three, literally. There are three, literally. There are literally three end cities that have insane loots and end city and ships. Again, as you know, they have elytra. So, basically. You have super good luck when looking for an end city because super rare. It is super rare to find an end city that has all that good stuff. 
But I found this C with super good end city loot. And I'm gonna drop down. C, three stories. That means there's a loot chest. I'm gonna let this one live so I can show you what a choker does. And C. Let me show you what a choker does by going to survival and turn difficulty to easy. See, they fire these virus-like projectiles at you that you hit them and you give you levitation. Not good when you fall down to your death. And they can also deduct health points while they do it. Okay, let's get back to creative. I'm done goofing around. And again, you have end ships. Oh, I got you. You have potions of instant health, and of course, you have elytras. There we go, see? And now to the last end city that has all that cool shit. Y'all know the coordinates now, so y'all know how to get there. And um, this is a very tiny end city, but ba-boom, end ship. Again, it's super rare to have an end ship nearby, but this this seed in Minecraft shows three end ships in a row. So if you want to go to end cities after you defeat the Ender Dragon and get some insane loot, this is your seed to do it. Woo! Diamond armor. I hope you guys enjoyed this um video. If you do subscribe, you like and make sure you give me more subscribers. And hope you enjoy Winter Remastered and the seed for it, Bula.